another video. Another video. Oh, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to talk about Pokemon Masters EX tips and tricks, ice types. So since Christmas is coming tomorrow, I think it's a great idea to talk about some ice type Pokemon and ice type sync pairs. So there are seven ice type sync pairs in total, and it's on day I have I'm I'm recording this. We have Lorelei, Lapras, Price, and Dugong, Canis, and Bombless Snow, Bryce, and and Cryogonal, Wolf, Frick, and Avlog, Glacia and Glady, and Steven and Alolan Sand Slash. So these are the sync pairs uh, that have Ice type. So let's uh, take a take a look at them one by one. First is Lapras, Lord and Lapras, the Candle Leaf Four member. Lapras is being a bit underrated, but actually Lapras can be pretty strong. First, uh, Lapras has Hostile Environment One, can freeze. Um, the opponents and Blizzard is an AoE move that hits everyone and there's a 10% chance to freeze and we got a booster so it's around 20% so that is really cool so if you guys don't have a good ice type Lapras is one of those you can consider using next is Price and Seal or Dugong so uh, pr I don't suggest anyone using Price or Dugong because first you would Icy Wind is actually pretty weak and like icy wind or lowest is speed and it takes a lot of gorges to charge and like speed is not too important when you're battling against uh npc opponents so i don't suggest anyone using a uh, price super duper effective too can be pretty good and price is free to play so i think price is decent but not the best next we have Kenneth and abominus though the one and only hell setter uh, the other one is a long sand slash, but that is after a sync move. Hell caused a hell storm, and there are many like um, sync grade that has to work with hell. Can be really good, but can suck at the same time. It all depends if you want to use hell or not. But if you're not using hell, Candles is not good. But if you're using hell, then she's pretty good. So on to the next Pokemon is Bryson and Cryogonal, another pretty unrated, but Bryson and Cryogonal uh, is actually really good. I have used Bryson and Cryogonal quite a lot before um, I recorded. I started doing YouTube videos, um, especially during 2019, Lance and Cynthia event, Ice type training events, battling uh, Garchomp, Dragonite, Powsan, Haxorus, Victory. <coughs> Sorry, Victory Bell, all those ice types. I use Bryce and Cragonal a lot, especially for Stone Cold Endurance, Enduring the Hit, and Haze. Haze is a very important um, move, which resets raised stats of our opposing thing versus normal. A really good move, and especially if, for example, if a legendary Pokemon raised the stats to a really high plus six, using Haze, it can remove all those uh, move, all those stat boosts. A really good move, and everyone should try using it. Especially when you cannot beat some specific states, specific stages because of the boost problems. Next, we have Wolfric and Avlock. I don't want to mention this too much because someone is gonna say that Wolfric is really good. Someone is gonna say Wolfric is really bad. But Wolfric can do actually tons of damage depending on how you use Wolfric. I'm not gonna talk about it too much because I'm not too familiar with this sync here. On to Hoenn Elite Four member Glacia and Glady. Glady is a uh, support sync pair, and X Regional is the main thing, basically to heal, and that's basically it. It's not too good, but can be uh, a really good sync pair to heal. And Snow Shelter and Fortress Four can be decent. Not good. It's not good, but it's decent. I just say it's decent. Last but not least, the best Ice type sync pair. Um, before 2020 Christmas is Steven, Summer Steven 2020 and Alone Sand Slash. So uh, with the fighting, having Ice Go Spear as a crash, as attack, what does it is. So the Sun Special is Hellbringer causes a hailstorm after a sync move. So uh, when I said about Candice, Candice can summon the rain. Hang on. Uh, yeah, I just mentioned that uh, Candice can summon the hell. But Summon Steven can also do that as well after using a sync move. It will boost um, this move. The move is called Infiltrating Hell 5, post up a move in Hellstorm, uh, which you can do massive damage under Hell. Icicle Crash has a chance to flinch, it's pretty good. Icicle Spear is also really good. Um, 
So Icicle Speed is really good as well, but some of you guys might even wonder uh, what if it doesn't hit or what if it misses. This thing doesn't need to be worried by a Sand Slash because cool as it is, raises the accuracy and critical hit rate in the Hailstorm, so it can prevent the accuracy problems and X attack can be really cool with being a physical attacker. So I think Steven and Alone Sensor is the best, the best ice type uh, user um, to this date. And if you guys do have Alone Sand Slash, do use him. I really like Alone Sensor, especially battling Agatha and Golbat. And in the, coming, in the upcoming Jota Champion Stadium, you have to battle Koga with ice types, having the Crobat, Dragalge, and those um, with two ice dragon and flying type with the ice. So yeah, this is going to be the end of the video and I've given a quick review of all the ice types. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't and I'm sorry for the interruption between the videos, but I still hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I think there's something to mention that is there are lots of uh, ice types that can be added in the game, but um, unfortunately ice types are, uh, there are too many ice types. There are too little ice types in the game. So I hope the game actually adds some decent ice types as well because some of you guys don't have alone sand slash and basically you don't have a good ice type sync here. So besides uh, sand slash, Lorelei and Dugong can be a good choice as well. So I'll see you in the next video. See ya.